Hey guys, welcome to Archery Fit, fueled by Mountain Ops. Today, I'm gonna to tell you why I always run my sight bars in close to my riser. I see a lot of people, famous guys, who run their sight bars about three feet out in front of their riser. Um, and I know like when you're rifle shooting, gun shooting, the longer your barrel, the more accurate it is. And the further you can get your sight away from your peep, supposedly the more accurate it is. But what a lot of people don't realize is humans aren't perfect. People aren't perfect, we don't make perfect shots. And when you torque your bow, I'm gonna show you an example. And I torque that bow at all, then that sight moves. Well, when I torque that bow to the left, and I'm trying to make that shot, I have to move that sight to the right and it's gonna change my impact. That's why torque changes accuracy. It makes bows less accurate. So the longer that bar is, the longer that side is away from my bar, that little movement out here turns into a lot more movement. So that means you have to move that further to get it back on target, which means your impact is gonna be way more off. So the closer you can get that side into your hand, the less distance it's moving when you torque that bow, the less you're gonna to have to move it to bring it back on target and the closer to the dot or your aiming spot you're gonna hit. That's why I bring my side in pretty close to my riser. I've always had good luck doing that. Hope it helps you.